Richard taking up all my time, man. Stan Jonas with you? Would you like sitting here with you? Yes. Hey, Rachel are here. You know what it is. So I haven't, seen, haven't interviewed you in a while, Freddie. This is the Olympic Stan Jonas. He trains Freddie. He's on the card. Okay, can you introduce us to him, Freddie? Um, well, this is my uh, my best prospect in the world, is Montez, <laughs> and uh, my future champion in that field. Uh, I haven't seen you in a while, Freddie. You're working with Richard Schaefer. It, it's amazing how small and how big the boxing world is when at the end of the day, we're really all friends at, in, this, in this game, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. We all are friends. We're all like support each other and so forth and we're looking for the, uh, the best to fight the best and uh, that's what we're doing here. And uh, you're going from the grassroots now, from the bottom up now. Zero and zero prospects and ask, you have obviously have asked race of taking him and to the know, green belt. The thing is, I mean, it's the future of boxing and uh, you know, we had uh, four Olympians on the same show. It's going to be really exciting, a lot of talent and uh, I can't wait to I, I can't wait for him to show his skills to the world. And April 9th, you expect the first round knockout. What's the what's the ideology going into a guy fighting his, his very first professional fight? What do you whisper in his ear? Uh, you know, he's definitely uh, he's ready for it. He's ready for it, so I know that. So I, uh, there's nothing really I have to whisper in his ear. Just uh, you know, go out there and uh, have some fun and uh, do your job, and that's that's what I, I intend to do uh, out there. And you know, we're not going to go out there looking for a first round knockout. If a knockout comes, I'll be a bonus. But the thing is, uh, we're just going to show our skills and be the guy every minute of every round. And I'll be remiss if I didn't ask you about Manny Pacquiao. What's going on? Where are y'all? Um, we don't have a fight at this point. <laughs> I, I did read yesterday he's going to fight in South Africa against Chris Van Heerden. I don't think that's true. But, um, you know, with uh, him being in the Philippines and me being here, uh, communi communication is a little bit difficult. And uh, until I get the call to go to the Philippines and start training them, um, I don't think there's anything out there. There's nothing definite out there at this moment. It seems like it seems like you and Bob Manny Pacquiao's camp and Bob Arum's camp are saying two different things going in two different directions. Is that true? I, I interviewed Bob Arum a couple of weeks ago. He says they're not. Amir Khan is not fighting them, and Khan said you guys aren't fighting. Well. We heard that they were negotiating in Dubai, yes, but then Bob told me that it's not going to happen. And how can you even negotiate a deal without the promoter? <laughs> it's very difficult. So uh, I don't know if it, what's true and what's not true. I don't. Um, so me and Manny don't talk on the phone every day and stuff like that. We don't talk on the phone at all. I see Manny. We respect each other. We go to work. We start training. No problems. He's over there and I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for the phone call to come to the Philippines and start training for his next fight. But right now we don't have a fight. And 